In today's video, I'm going to be discussing and revealing how much money Social Security has left. I have all the details and exactly what you need to know right here on the video. Let's get into it and talk through all the details. I right, know this is a question that does come up on a fairly regular basis from many people and beneficiaries also rightfully want to know the answer to this as well, which is, um, how much money does Social Security have left? Now, again, here's the thing as well. How many times throughout our lives have we heard statements along the lines of Social Security's bankrupt, Social Security's ending, Social Security's going away, Social Security benefits are stopping, and the list goes on and on. I think all of us have heard statements like this at some point throughout our life. I don't think I'm the only one that has heard this, right? We've all heard these things many times. Well, in this video, I do want to discuss and reveal to you exactly how much money Social Security has in their so-called savings account, otherwise known as the trust funds, which is where that money comes into and goes out of for the beneficiaries. So I have all those numbers for you here in this video. Let's talk through all those details. However, really fast before we do, can I ask a huge favor of you? If you have not done so yet, or if you happen to be new here, first off, welcome and thank you so much for joining me. I really do appreciate your support. Will you please make sure to subscribe to the channel by hitting the subscribe button right down below the video? It is totally free to do so. I'm here for you every single day. I'm watching the headlines, doing the research, advocating on your behalf, keeping you posted on everything going on, answering questions, doing anything I possibly can right now to help you out, to be here for you every single day. It's a rough time out there. We all get this. And again, we've all got to stick together right now. Finances for most people are really, really rough and it's a tough a tough time out there. I'm here for you every single day. So again, please subscribe down below if you haven't done so yet. Totally free to do so. Only if you haven't done so. Thank you so much. Please subscribe to the channel and let's talk through all these numbers that you probably want to know and what you're here for. All right. So let me talk through exactly what we've learned based on a recent report that was released by Social Security and the Social Security Board of Trustees and their annual report. Now remember, this is a report that comes out once per year. Year. And we get this report and it gives us all the different finances of Social Security. And I want to give you some of these very important numbers here in this video, okay? So I'm going to tell you this much. I'm going to talk through some very big, big numbers. We're not talking millions. We're not talking billions. We're not even talking hundreds of billions. We're talking trillions, multiple trillions of dollars. And I'm going to shake out all of those details for you here in this video, okay? Now, first things first, you might want to know, based on what I, you know, preface this video with, as I said, how much money does Social Security have left, okay? Remember this much as well. Where does Social Security get their money? Do they just, um, you know, pull money out of thin air and just, you know, it grows on trees for them? Well, that's not the case. It'd be super awesome if that was the case, but that is not how it works, right? Remember, Social Security gets their money in three different ways. Number one, they get the bulk of their money through Social Security payroll taxes. This is FICA tax taxes on your pay stub. If you ever looked on your pay stub, you see, wait, there's federal taxes, there's state taxes, and there's FICA. What is FICA, right? Well, FICA is Social Security and Medicare taxes, okay? They get 6.2% uh, from the from the employee, as in you, and they get 6.2% from the employer on your behalf. And if you're self-employed, you have the luxury of paying all 12.4%, okay? Now, Medicare is on top of that as well, another 1.45% on each side as well, okay? Um, but anyway, that is where Social Security gets the bulk of their money every single year. However, they also get money from taxation of Social Security benefits from some people who have incomes over certain thresholds, and they also do get a little bit of money on uh, interest of the trust funds as well, okay? So those are the three primary methods in which Social Security gets money in which they pay money out to the beneficiaries. But uh, how much money do they really have left? Is it a uh, little bit of money here? Well, let me tell you exactly the number, okay? Now remember, um, this is as of right now. This number is changing like all the time because money's coming in, money's going out. This is a number that is never staying constant. It is never a static number. It is always changing, basically for the most part. A lot of money changing hands here in a major, major way. Anyway, based on the most recent Social Security Board of Trustees report, here's what they found. Based on uh, the current numbers right now, sitting in the trust funds. When I say trust funds, I'm talking about two different trust funds, okay? I'm talking about the Disability Trust Fund and the Old Age and Survivors Trust Fund, okay? Two different trust funds. Combined, they have $2.788 trillion. 
It's a ton of money, okay? So to put that light layer, to put that a little bit more easily here, just under $2.8 trillion is what they have, okay? $2.788 trillion is how much they have in the trust funds, according to the most recent Social Security Board of Trustees report. It's a lot of money, okay? If you're not sure how much that is, just to, trust me when I say that's a ton of money. That's a lot, a lot, a lot of money, okay? Now, let me uh, give you some more details on this as well, because you might be in kind of curious about the whole details as far as okay that's a lot but like how much longer is that going to last okay let me tell you this much as well based on again the social security board of trustees report last year okay so as i film this video right now we're in 2024 the social security board of trustees gives us numbers on the most recent full year so last year 2023 okay we do not have all the numbers for 2024 that'll come out in 2025 so you know next year 2025 okay but anyway based on these most recent numbers here here's what they found in 2023 the social security administration brought in 1.35 uh sorry 1.351 trillion dollars in income this is income through social security payroll taxes interest on uh the trust funds as well as taxation of benefits 1.351 trillion dollars it's a ton of money. Again, that's a nice income <laughs> for anybody. Could you imagine earning $1.351 trillion in a year? <laughs> that'd be pretty cool, right? <laughs> that'd be a that'd be really cool. You'd be um, by far the high, highest paid person in the world in history for a very long time. That'd be incredible, right? Anyway, now get this. They also reported that their expenses for the same year, 2023, were $1.392 trillion. But wait. Did you just say income was 1.351 and expenses were 1.392? Yes, exactly, okay? So yes, expenses exceeded their income last year in 2023. In other words, they lost $41 billion last year, which simply means that they spent $41 billion more than they actually brought in uh, through their, you know, through their income sources. Okay. So yes, this is what it has, uh, comes down to. But when we look at the trust funds, again, $2.788 trillion in the trust fund. And when I say trust fund, again, that can be a little bit confusing. Just think of it this way, savings account. When I, when I say say, uh, trust fund, just replace it with savings account. That's kind of literally the same thing out here. Okay. So social security has in their, um, metaphorical savings account here, $2.788 trillion. It's a lot of money sitting in the savings account. Okay. My point is, they have a lot of money coming in through Social Security payroll taxes, through taxation on benefits. That's not that much, um, about $51 billion, according to the report, and also interest on benefits. Again, that's very minimal as well, but the bulk, well over a trillion dollars coming in from, again, Social Security payroll taxes. That's where they get the bulk of the money right there, okay? So my point is, they have a lot of money here, and Social Security is not going away anytime soon. Because even if all of the incomes uh, dried up, okay, even if all that income dried up and they had zero money coming in, in any income sources, Social Security pays out, well, again, you just saw right there, the total expenses of the year, $1.392 trillion, okay? That simply means, based on the current trust fund, if, they've, if they had zero income coming in, if all income ended, which it's not, it's not going to end for them, I was just saying, if all income ended for Social Security, they would have at least two years sitting in the trust funds that they could send out to beneficiaries, totally fine, at least two years. But again, that's if all income ended. The income is not going away. If anything, income is going to continue to go up for them going forward, okay? My point is, Social Security is not ending. Social Security is not going away. They have a lot of money here, okay? Just under $2.8 trillion. That's a lot to sit here and go forward, okay? Anyway, I can come back and elaborate on this further if you want me to, but um, these are the numbers I wanted to share with you really quickly. I find it to be very fascinating. And again, these were these are huge numbers we're dealing with. We're not talking like a million dollars. A million dollars is a lot of money, but a million dollars when it comes to Social Security is nothing. That's literally nothing, okay? So anyway, hope this helps you. But again, I want to uh, bring this into your attention so you can see what's going on if you've not done so. Again, please subscribe down below. Totally free to do so. Check out any of the other thousands of videos here on the channel, including those in the video library. Otherwise, down below in the comment section and the top of the description, I have uh, hand-selected some videos for you there. Check those out. Otherwise, right now, popping up on your screen, you'll see some videos as well. Make sure to check out one of those. So take your selection now, and I'll see you again in just a minute in the next video. Again, thank you so much for your support. Really do appreciate it. Enjoy your day. Take care, and I'll see you again in just a second here in the next